Other whose family is rocked to the core after this scaffolding accident at Tivoli Village. That accident happened just a little over 24 hours ago when scaffolding collapsed. We've also learned the victim was a father of three. 13 Action News anchor Leslie Marine is live at Tivoli Village right now with more. Leslie. Trisha, Steve, it was at this construction site right here where Ricardo Bautista had worked on scaffolding for the last several months. Now we're told yesterday was supposed to be his day off. Instead, he still came in and it ended in tragedy. <laughs> I said, just take the day off. He said, no, I'm going to go. And he did. But Ricardo Bautista never made it back home to his wife and three kids. He's telling me he wants to go see his dad in the hospital. <laughs> Jacqueline has a hard time talking as her brother remembers the last words he said to the hardworking father. I'm going to be careful because I, I work there. Investigators say a few hours into Ricardo's shift, the scaffolding the labor worker was on collapsed. Fire crews rushed to the site but couldn't help him. The only thing that he used to tell me was, yeah, he used to say that he was scared being so high. And I told him, you should find another job. He's like, he's like, this is the only job that I think that pays the most. Money, Jacqueline says, only went to one thing. They're three boys. He said he wanted to give his kids something he didn't have. That's why he was always working. Well, the company he works for has told the family they'll be setting up a GoFundMe page in his name. Once we get that, we will put it on our website at KTMV.com. At 6, hear more from his family and why they say this could have been prevented. Reporting live, Leslie Money in 13 Action News. Leslie, thank you. A motorcycle.